Hello, Facebook friends. This is Dale Callahan coming to you for Ask Dr. Callahan. And tonight we want to hit a subject where we want to hit the questions that we keep getting, uh, having to answer on our support page and some of the other pages um, uh, about some of the products that we're dealing with. So what we're doing here is, is we are providing high school math, uh, primarily math and some science stuff and some career advice and some planning. Uh, on our site, Ask Dr. Callahan, we, our products, everything we're trying to do is prepare, help you prepare your students for college and career and for, for life. You know, we, we always take the end in mind, looking at what does the university want, but not only what does university want, what does the job market want? How are you preparing your kids to be successful, not just to pass an ACT and SAT and get scholarships and do all those great things, but how can you actually get them beyond that and to find a career that they love to do and they're passionate about? That is what our college and career planning course is focused on. I'm not going to talk about that tonight, but just that's the mindset we want is we want you to have the tools uh, that, to, to uh, prepare your students. Uh, you know, when we look at a lot of the high school systems out there, uh, we have counselors and we have people that kind of help you down the path. But sometimes that's, that's pretty limited at the, the thinking that goes on there. So we want to do a little more than that. But tonight, the issue that keeps coming up to us is algebra and geometry. So if you go to our website, AskDrCallahan.com slash geometry or AskDrCallahan.com slash algebra, we have multiple products on there, but mostly, mostly it's a, a kit for doing all of algebra. So it's everything you need or you can buy it in, in, in parts. And we'll just pick on algebra here for a minute. Uh, the algebra and geometry, both courses were written by Harold Jacobs. The, the textbooks are. Uh, so this is where the confusion comes in. Uh, many of you have probably seen this textbook by uh, it's by Harold Jacobs. Uh, so we get the camera straight there. Uh, this, yeah, if I've borrowed Cassidy's copy here. So the uh, the this textbook is this textbook is his original. And this is heck, this thing's probably got a printing right here of uh, 1970, well, 1979 by Freeman. So this. This is kind of the classic. People are always asking, "What edition is it?" And this is, this is it. There's really one edition of algebra, but many people you're going to see covers like this, and on some of the photos on Amazon and some of the places you buy, you'll find this. These are not being printed anymore. This that looks like this. What is being printed now is uh, Master Books took over the printing, and we've sold out of them all. So I apologize, but I'm showing you the teacher's guide. But you'll see this little uh, the blue part here is the textbook. And that's what it should look like. And if you go to Master Books website or anything, that's what you will see. Uh, and it's Elementary Algebra by Harold Jacobs. It is not a different edition. It is the same textbook. That is the uh, they've changed some wording and some problems and things like that. They're minor changes, but uh, the, the the content of the textbook, everything else is the same. So a lot of people uh, have an old version, like I showed you at first, and they can do the course. They can use our DVDs. They can use our videos. They can use the solutions guide or they you may have the new copy and you can use the solution guide. So the either books are the same. They're all what we might call first edition, different printings. Um, so one thing that is different it is more of a layout issue than it is a uh, what's in the textbook. Uh, when Master Books took over the book or New Leaf Publishing Group, however they are referred to, but we're going to refer to them as Master Books. If when they took over the uh, the publication of the book, they 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 tried to get better paper and just I think they were wanting to make a better product, uh, and I believe they did do that. But to do that, they, they separated some of the problems out. So some of the problems that were in, uh, in algebra, there was problems set one, set two, set three, and sometimes a set four, or maybe every time a set four, I can't remember the, they separated some of them out and put them in this teacher's guide. That's why some of you are asking, do I really need the teacher's guide? Uh, yes, because the teacher's guide now contains the problems. It contains some other useful things that's, that you probably need to it. It contains the, pro the answer key. Let's just look on here what it says. It contains the weekly exams. Uh, the exams used to be a separate book. So right now, the, with uh, Master Books printing of this, you need the textbook and the teacher guide for this. And you pretty much have all the written material. Oh, and then the 
you have the written material that makes the textbook and then there's a solutions manual that goes in that so sorry i forgot to bring you the solutions manual to show you but there's two different solution manuals out there one of them looks very much like this it's by master books who took over the printing of it and another one we published one that's an orange copy um of a solutions manual for harold jacobs algebra they're all the same thing okay the inside is the same thing and uh so you know what you've got is the solutions to the problem so those those are good that just that kind of bothered when people go the, a lot of our customers that go into their websites and they're looking at things and say wow this is a different cover and this and this i want to make sure i got all the same editions so that the videos that i'm buying work with a textbook I know it's so confusing, but right now we're kind of in a point where there's inventory of both out there. It's so people are doing different things. Probably a lot of that will go away shortly, um, but it's the same content. That's the main thing. It's your students are going to learn the same thing just to make it more confusing. Um, this is the DVDs that taught the course uh, look like this. So this is uh, algebra. For some reason, I keep going out of camera shot. This is the algebra DVDs. And uh, can you see me? Yeah, there we go. That's better. This is the algebra DVDs that we produced uh, that uh, we've been selling for years. Uh, so if you go to our website, AskDrCallahan.com, you will see these DVDs. Masterbooks, though, uh, just contacted us uh, some time ago, uh, a year or so ago, and wanted to publish our DVDs. Uh, so they have taken over publication. If you buy from anybody but us, uh, from, if you buy from Masterbooks, Veritas, Rainbow Resources, Christian Book Distributors, any of those other people, you're going to be getting uh, something that looks like this. This is the same. This is a set of DVDs, same DVDs, same content. They took over the publication of it. So we probably will just start moving to selling these uh, or, or doing something else. I'll talk about in just a minute just to cut down the confusion. And, and there's a few other benefits to us. Uh, but if you buy, you know, either one of those you buy is the same thing. You've got the same content on the dvd uh generally except some you know little editing things but but the same teaching content is on both now there's a third option out there just because it's not confusing enough there's a third option we've put the dvd content online so if you go to our website you see uh online videos for algebra same content we did that partly because uh you know the world of dvds is going away uh, what an, you know, as my wife always says, you know, what an antiquated technology that, but that was even when they came out, you know, they get scratched, they get lost. We, I just can't tell you how many times we replace DVDs uh, because people have, they'll sell their DVD player and it will be in there or they'll give it away to Goodwill or something. Um, and, um, or it, we're just constantly, I mean, you know, we're keeping up with the set of DVDs is hard enough. Um, so the, as on our if you bought, buy the online series and you buy the the regular full thing, it's just like having the DVDs. You just don't have to put them in. You don't lose them. You have lifetime access. Uh, and we do do some. We're going to be doing some updates to online. We can do things online with the online series that we cannot do here. Like we can add content quickly. You can't do that. Takes a production issue to add them to uh, to a set of DVDs. So, but for DVDs, for videos, no matter which one you get, you want to get one of these two or you want to get the online, same content. Okay, so you cannot go wrong with algebra from Harold Jacobs. Uh, and Harold worked really hard on getting all this stuff put back together and getting the book and trying to get it cleaned up and doing some things to update. Um, he worked really hard on those kind of things trying to get it moved to the new publisher, but it's the same uh, general content. What did he change? You're saying, well, why, why was, why did he need to work hard? Um, if you know anything about the publishing world, figures, graphics, they have licenses for certain periods of time and those times were running out. So there's some figures that got changed. Uh, there were some things he changed in terms of some of the problems where I, I know one in particular that uh, Harold had a problem about a cassette tape and, you know, how much, uh, how many times it has to wind around. It was a math problem, right? So, but his cassette tape was an example and uh, master books thought, well, cassette tapes are, uh, the kids may not know what that means. So, you know, do some things just to update those kind of things. So he spent a lot of time, a lot of effort doing that. So uh, a great job between him and master books to put these together. But from your point of view, the student point of view, the parent from point of view, either one of these, they all go, they all mix together and you've got what you need. 
All right, so let me tell you a little bit about geometry because it has a similar story, a little, maybe a little more complicated, I don't know. Um, the geometry, if you have, uh, I don't know if this, there, actually there's a couple of versions of geometry that's out there. There's three printings of geometry, and I had one sitting here, but I don't know what I did with it. So anyway, I have one sitting somewhere. Uh, so there's a geometry that kind of has the Escher uh, uh, sketch on the front of it. You see it. It's kind of a yellow color, color with the, you know, look like an art gallery kind of sketch or a drawing. Um, let's just see if I have it. Ah, there it is. I just had to find it. Yes, because I was describing that horribly. Uh, so that's that's the that is a third edition. Now, this is an edition. This is a third edition geometry. Uh, as you see, and it's got the sketch there in front of it that I'm talking about. Uh, this is this one's been around for a long time. I don't know how long. Um, in a couple of years, they uh, Harold found another publisher for this. Harold Jacobs found another publisher for this. And you had a book that looked a lot like this. And so you'll still find these books. This is the same book. You'll even see it says third edition. Again, it's a different printing, uh, but that's the third edition. Uh, now, and I'm sorry, but I'm, we hit sold out of these too, and I didn't realize it. Uh, they they now look like uh, there's a cover that looks kind of like this, you know, that has this general design on it, and that's the newest cover, the newest printing by Master Books, who also took over this publication of Geometry. So now, if you're buying and you've got you know this older one here that uh, that I showed you first. Or you've got, uh, if you've got the one that uh, I think My Father's World is who published this one. That, and if you've got that one, uh, it's the same content inside. This new one, same content inside. But just like I said, up for the algebra, Harold uh, Jacobs went through some uh, editing and trying to get those things uh, updated. And, and they, they, the book's a little bit different feel, uh, but the content in, the, in them is the same. And again, probably as inventory changes, you know, you'll see those things change, but you might be buying used copies. Here's the thing that's different about geometry that you do need to think about. And we have an article on our website about it. There is a, since there's a third edition, there is a first and second and third edition, right? I haven't, I've never seen the first. The second edition is not like the third. So many times people will buy a used copy of the second edition of Geometry or some friend will give it to them and they'll want to use it along with our DVDs. Now, so we called uh, Harold Jacobs about this and said, you know, we first of all, we looked and said, well, our DVDs work with this. We'll just make them work. No, it's a it's a very different structure of the book. The second edition, the third edition, Harold Jacobs pointed out to us. And he, he gave me an email. He said, here's why. You just don't want to use the second edition. I've learned so much since then. I forget how he worded it, but basically he made a very compelling argument. Get the third edition. That's what the videos are going to support. Uh, that's and we have great recommendations of why. Uh, and it's I won't bore you with that. But um, so that book is going to be the third edition. Different printings, different color covers. That's OK. You'll see them in different places. Amazon, whatever. Just make sure you get the third edition. Um, the solutions manual, you know, is going to look like that. This is also published by Master Books. Uh, this is the, you know, this is the most current printing. Uh, but again, the, the colors and things are different. Uh, so the uh, that one has a solutions manual, a teacher's guide, and some similar uh, things like that uh, that you need to do to the course. Always buy the solutions manual to these courses, by the way, because look, we, look, I'm. I, I can do math. That's OK. But, uh, you know, when I when I'm helping people, a lot of times when people email us from support, the first thing we do is look at what did Harold Jacobs say the answer was. Now, part of the reason was is because, well, it's just the fastest thing for us to do. Uh, but also we want to make sure that we are answering the question in the spirit of what he was trying to do rather than try to give a more complicated answer. We want to give the answer he was he was going after sometimes sometimes uh, questions will throw you off and you're thinking he's asking something else and not. So always have the solutions manual. It just makes sure it makes mom's life easier. And for what? Probably 20 or 30 bucks. It's worth, really worth it. 
like the algebra and <clears throat> there is uh we have uh this is our original printing of the dvds or at least the ones we've been doing the last couple of years and uh and so this is the dvd series the video series and now master books has taken over those and same story uh anybody that if, if you buy the harold jake i mean if you buy uh that's dr callahan dvd series it's now published by master's books if you buy it from anybody but us you're going to get this except maybe a used copy on eBay or something. Uh, so you're going to see those. The content is the same, same content again, except with some, you know, minor editing things that has nothing to do with the math uh, things that we did to, to, uh, to help master books and satisfy what they needed. We also have the online version of that for the same reason. So there's an online version. Uh, it's like, I think it's $90. Uh, so it's a it's a lifetime access or there's a month to month, which is obviously is not a lifetime access, uh, but it's the same content. And like algebra for us, we will uh, we will uh, be supporting that and growing, you know, adding content to that. The we probably will do away with these and we may carry these uh, or refer people to master's books. However, that works because obviously online is the best for us. Gee, is this a lot of confusing stuff, but here's the message. Here's the main thing is if you've got algebra, basically, no matter what the color looks like, what cover looks like, you've got the right stuff. If you've got the um, if you've got geometry, as long as it's the third edition, no matter what the cover looks like, you've got the right stuff. So I hope this helps. We're going to try to clarify some of this and some of the writing on the website. And of course, we got some photos to update and things like that also. Uh, but I just want to encourage uh, parents that are out there shopping that you're OK. We're going to uh, you've got the right stuff and uh, you can get it from different people. And that's every, all that's still the same as it's always been. So hopefully that helps. If you've got any questions or you want to, you know, you can always comment to us on Facebook or you can email us at support at AskDrCallahan.com. Uh, and we'll get, get right back to you. All right. Thanks a lot. Have a great night.